We are the Science Cowboys. We shoot science from the hip. In this episode of Science Cowboys, we're going to learn how to make perfumes. Perfume is a mixture of fragrance, accession, oils, or aroma compounds used to give the human body animal food subject and leaving space a pleasant sense. The perfume dates back to more than 4,000 years. The Persian chemist Avicenna introduced the process of extracting oil from flour by means of distillation. The art of perfumery was known in Western Europe from 1221, between the 16th and 17th centuries. Perfume were used primarily by the wealthy to mask body odors resulting from infrequent bathing. Motivation of the project, making perfumes at home to make life more fun. In this project, we want to make perfumes from orange, lemon, and lime peels, rose petals, chili seeds, green tea, and ground coffee. Hypothesis of the experiment. We can extract essential oils from various plants using distillation or solvent extraction. Methodology of the experiment. Distillation. To do distillation, first add orange peels to water. Then warm up the flusk. Then water starts evaporating and orange oil is released. As water evaporates, oil, orange oil is carried away with water vapor. Water vapor and orange oil can be collected by using a nozzle. When nozzle is cooled, vapors condense. Orange oil and water separate. Condensed orange oil is collected in a beaker on top of water. And now we're going to show you how it's done in practice. Now we're preparing our distillation experiments. So guys, what are you doing exactly? Alex, so tell we're me. We're going to crush or the orange um, skins. And are they dried or fresh? They're dried. And then it, we were going to crush them into smaller pieces and put them in the beaker. Very and good. And Nastushka, uh, what are you crush, doing? Um, roses skin. Where are you getting the roses petals? From the roses over here. Where did we get those? Are they fresh roses? They're dried roses. Very good. We spent months drying them up. And what are you going to do with those roses? I'm going to crush them up and put them all in this beaker. Second beaker. So guys, you know what we're going to do after that? We're gonna put a lot of boiled water oh, in it. In, mm -hmm. the, in the beaker. Uh huh. We're gonna boil the water there. And then it's gonna evaporate the oils. Very steam. good. Uh, when uh, uh, water uh, boils, it's gonna take the oils from the orange skin and the petals, and then it's gonna carry the oil through the distillation setup. And it's gonna condense the oil in the beaker. Well, that's a theory we're gonna test. Maybe it's not gonna work. I bet it's not gonna work. Oh, maybe it will. All right, go to work, little elves. Okay guys, this is working really well. Can you explain me how the distillation setup works? Yes. yes. Okay Alex, start. So here it's the vapors. We need vapor. Uh -huh. And then mix the with oils. Mm -hmm. with oils. Mm -hmm. Then the vapor goes up here. Uh -huh. Very good. And goes here and and it goes in this long tube. Uh-huh. What happens in the long tube, Nastika? Um, the water flows here. Um, the cold water the cold flows, water flows to cool down the tube, and what happens? And then um, we get some perfume. 
It's a mix of essential yes. oil and Perfect. water. So it's essential oil with water ends up in a beaker. Yeah? Okay, science cowboys. Bye bye. Bye bye. Now we're going to talk about using solvent extraction to make perfume. First, we have to add orange peels to ethanol. After some time, orange oil is released and it dissolves in ethanol. At the end, we have to filter out oil extract using a funnel and filter paper. We could also receive pure essential oils by evaporating ethanol. Now we're going to show you how it's done in practice. All right, guys. So, we did a lot of things today. So, let's summarize what we did so far. So, Nani, tell how we started. So, first, we peeled um, a fruit, an uh -huh. orange, a lemon, and a lime. Uh -huh. Then, we dried it for... Very good. For two or one week and then and then we, Alex gonna tell us what do you do then when you dry the skin we took some orange skin uh -huh, a peel or a peel of lime and Nanchka took some lemon and, and go crunch it crunch it, and then crunch we get it. it into some crunched orange skin, skin? We, we put it where show we us again no, and we show we put it in a beaker and and we fill it up with, with what? alcohol. Very good with ethanol. With ethanol. And Nasushka. So we filled it with ethanol and after what? What happened after? Then after after we wait for two weeks. Uh-huh. And, and then we filter it. Uh-huh. And it makes this like beautiful, pure, beautiful tinctures, tinctures, pure. So show me what you started for those things on the top. Zero. Take some beakers, take some beakers, show They're me. Looking really Ew, really sediment, good. yucky stuff. That's a skin, that's a skin. Good, good. And then we got some. Oh, chili peppers. Thing. Ooh, dangerous. And we filtered it out and we get what? What did we get? We got beautiful. Oh, scent. beautiful tinctures. Okay, so name them, name them. Um, orange, First, orange, orange lemon, 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 lime, lime, hot chili pepper, good, tea, tea. and that's not a tincture. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so you know what we're gonna do next? No, I guess you don't know. Next, we're gonna open the tinctures like this. Hold on, no, I'll do that. We're gonna open it like this and we're gonna leave it for one or two days. You know what's gonna happen? It's gonna it evaporate. evaporate and the level of tincture, the amount of tincture will be way smaller. Does it smell nice right now? Mm -hmm. Yeah. But when it's we gonna smell better. it's gonna smell even better. And and some of it, some of it we're gonna even evaporate to oil. Is that right? Yes. Okay, that's good. Let me show you where we're gonna put the oil. Oh, it's so cool. We have tiny, tiny little beakers. There we go. There we go. So the tiny little beakers. And that's where we're gonna get our oil. Show the beakers. Show the beakers. In front, yeah, tiny beakers. And we're gonna fill them there's uh, uh, pretty much with oil. Some of them smell stronger and some of them smell less strong. Okay, that's right. For example, right. the tea and the hot chili pepper. They smell very strong? No, the tea smells less strong and the hot chili pepper is super, pepper's strong, super huh? strong. Okay, Alex, what is your favorite? My favorite is the lime. It's the lime. Okay, and Papa's favorite? If you all mix together, <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys, say bye bye. Bye bye. See you in a week when we're gonna get some oils done, okay? Bye. It actually took us 
more than a month to evaporate the tinctures to produce perfume. Also, as ethanol evaporates, you notice the droplets of essential oils forming on the walls of the test tubes. So we start with by a tincture that's lemon, for example. What is a tincture, Nani? A tincture is the... It's not... It's like oils with lots of lots of alcohol. And mm -hmm. then after a month, four weeks, we made um, a concentrated perfume. We don't want all of it to be evaporated. That's right. We want about this much of perfume that, of alcohol. That's right. That's so what we did, we concentrated the oils. We took a tincture we left it open for a month and then it became perfume which is just a concentrated tincture we just evaporated alcohol but left all the oils inside okay so what are you gonna do now so we're gonna see if the perfume smells more than the tincture ah. so we wrote on each vial one is perfume, tincture, perfume, tincture, perfume, tincture, That's and That's right. So we're gonna place next to each other tincture and a perfume, and then we're gonna give it to Alex uh, blindfolded. He's gonna smell it and tell us whether indeed perfume smells stronger than a tincture. Right? Yes. Yeah. Very good. All the way to the top? Yes. Very good. Just a little bit more. That's okay. You don't have to. Okay. Close it up. Oh, no, 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 no. With two hands. Mm -hmm. So this is our first tincture. Hold on, hold on. Let me, let me see. Yes, the tincture of lemon. Go ahead with putting perfume next to it have to confirm in a blind experiment that perfume smells stronger than tincture at least we hope so okay Nastushka put on your blindfold we start with orange very good so you marked which one you're gonna open first don't tell Nanu Anastasia very good so smell it uh, smell it smell it and remember it. Did you smell it? Mm -hmm. Okay, close it, do it fast, and then the second one, second one. Smell it, smell it. Which one is the strongest? The first one or the second one? Second one. It's good. It's good. So she guessed that it's the second one, which is perfume. Very good. Yes, so exchange the blindfolds, guys. So Nanya, Anastasia gives a blindfold to Alex. So next one is lime. Okay, Alex, put your blindfold on. We are testing lime. Very good, like this. Okay, you're testing number one. Put it under his nose. Is it good, Alex? You're mm -hmm. smelling it? Number two now, please close it. Number two. Which one is the strongest? Number two. Number two is the strongest. Yes, yes we guessed it right again. So, perfume smells stronger than a tincture. Conclusion! Hypothesis of the experiment is correct! We can use distillation or solvent extraction to produce fragment liquids. This was a production of Stadormai Kanabek.